this video shows how easy it is to add uh, capture uh, uh, form validation to a dialog component in version 11. So you can see here that we have a simple dialog component that's just got three controls and then a submit and a clear button and if I go to working preview you can see here are the three controls A, B and C but we've displayed here a, a capture a data validation f um, uh, image so that uh, the uh, developer uh, can ensure that a person and not a machine is filling in the dialog. So in order to do this, all that we had to do was go to uh, uh, this third field here to C, and you can see here we've gone and um, we've just simply checked the uh, capture form validation, so we've checked that field. We specified the number of characters we'd like uh, to appear in the capture uh, image. Uh, we've specified the image uh, height and width in inches. We've specified what the icon is to refresh um, the image. And um, then we specified the uh, bubble help for the icon and then the error message that, um, that we'd like to display um, uh, in, in the field. So now let's go ahead now and uh, uh, run the dialog so you can see here's the uh, dialog and then there's the uh, image and if you, you can't quite make out the letters you can then click the icon there to refresh it and get another version so that one looks good so let's go there and type in some values and then go here and type in a value that we know is wrong so we submit and you can see there um, the uh, error message appears and then a new um, uh, capture image is generated so I'll go here and type in Z A K C M Y O Z and now I'll submit it again and this time basically the data is correct so the form submits correctly. Thanks very much.